All right, let's talk about winter kill. It's a big topic right now. All, so many courses throughout this region of the country are suffering from it right now. So I wanna to talk to you today a little bit about what is winter kill, uh, what causes it, and what we're doing to try to try to fix it. So um, as I'm here at Tex Consolver Golf Course today, and they have Bermuda fairways. And winter kill is basically, um, it's the bare spots that you may see in some of the fairways. Um, it's What happens is the Bermuda, as you go into the fall, we had a really dry season. Uh, the temperature stayed pretty high right up until around Christmas when they dropped dramatically and we had the negative temperatures for about four days. That basically stunts the grass. It's like having frostbite on the grass. Um, so in the in the spring, when you when the golf courses start to come out, there are areas that still suffer from that and the grass doesn't come out. Unfortunately, this year was extremely bad. Um, not just here, but again, all courses uh, with Bermuda across the entire region of the country. A lot of the sod farms are out of sod right now because so many places are having to replace the Bermuda, uh, the bad spot. So what we're trying to do, we obviously know there, there are issues, especially at Sim where it has a sandy base and it was really dry. Um, we, we know that we have issues. The problem is you have to have warm temperatures before you can really start to fix these problems. And there's a rule of 150. And what that means is basically you take every day, you take the low temperature for that day and the high temperature for that day and you add them together. If they don't get to above 150, so if it was 60 as a low, 80 as a high, that's 140. It's not quite to 150. A general rule, is you have to be above 150 before these things will really start to take effect and, and work themselves out. So we still need a little bit more help from Mother Nature. It looks like that weather's coming around the corner. Um, we're at Tex right now. We have areas roped off where we used a sprigging machine to spit to uh, sprig fairway, or I'm sorry, sprig Bermuda in these bad spots. So with that warm temperature, we'll water it, we'll, we'll put fertilizer and different stuff on it to make sure that these areas fill in as fast as possible. Really, the, what we need is the warm weather. We're almost there. So I, I understand that the fairways aren't where we want them, but it's that way with all, so many courses in this region. We are working very hard to get it fixed for you. And I think in a few weeks of warm weather, you'll see a dramatic difference. So thank you for your patience. And we look forward to having great grass in the fairways very soon.